Hi everyone, my name is Meher Aladi, and in this video I'd like to give you a short overview on our recent work on building a forest inventory using LiDAR data collected by mobile robots. Forests are crucial for our ecosystem. They support multiple critical processes like biodiversity, uh, carbon sequestration, and provide timber to human industries, support human leisure activities, and so on. Monitoring and documenting the status of forests is a time and labor intensive task for humans. Traditionally, this is done by forest researchers, by them going into the forest and manually measuring all the information that they are interested in. We can instead use robots to automate such data collection for us, where we could send, say, the animal robotic platform equipped with a velodyne laser scanner into the forest to collect data for us, which we can then use to perform accurate reconstructions. In terms of the forestry metrics that we might be interested in, we can look at the leaf structure of trees, or we can look at the wooden structure or branch structure in, of the trees in the forest, and so on. In our work, we focus on estimating the parameter known as the diameter at breast height, or DBH, which is the diameter of the tree trunk measured 1.3 meters above the ground. This parameter is considered the most crucial in forestry, owing to its use in multiple downstream tasks, like uh, estimating forest biomass, projecting forest growth, and so on. So with that, our approach to building a forest inventory is critically learning free. We do not rely on the existence of labels as might be needed for a deep learning based approach. Instead, we take a density based approach to segmenting the trees and then we model those trees using geometric primitives to estimate the traits we're interested in, in our case, the DBH. So the result of our instance segmentation approach is shown here, for example, on data collected from the Velodyne laser scanner equipped on the animal robotic platform. And then once we have such an instance segmentation, we can process each tree instance by instance by fitting geometric primitives to them to estimate the DBH that we are interested in. If you are interested in further details of our approach, you can go through our paper linked here on the left, or you can also inspect our open source implementation that we provide in the GitHub repository linked here on the right. Thank you very much for your attention.